Hi, I'm Rich Breckner with Anside HPC. We're here at the GPU Technology Conference at the Penguin booth, and I'm here with David Ingersoll from Penguin. So David, how are you doing today? I'm doing excellent. How about yourself, Rich? Great, great. You know, I heard about the new hot box you got here, and uh, can you tell us more about it? Yeah, we're very pleased and excited to announce at uh, GTC our Reliant 2808 GT. It's uh, two Intel Xeon Sandy Bridge processors that are driving eight of the uh, NVIDIA GPUs on the Kepler, the KT20s. And uh, you also have eight uh, hot swappable two and a half inch uh, SATA or SAS drives. And we're excited that we've been able to form this in, or fit this into a 2U form factor. So we're giving a lot of GPU compute power in a very dense space for a lot of the academic research and uh, image processing for entertainment and gaming and other industries that could take advantage of that kind of compute power. Uh, it looks like a lot of DIMM slots as well, a lot of memory in this, this node? Or? Yeah, great question. We could load it up with uh, 512 gigabytes of uh, RAM, so you could load a lot of uh, images in, the, in your processing space and get a lot of uh, very dense GPU compute power. Yeah, so, so when you put that many GPUs in a small space, how are you dealing with the heat? That's where Penguin uh, really separates itself, is we put our uh, engineers on the problem, and they're able to come up with a very unique fan design to make sure that the air is circulating and keeping the entire system cool enough uh, to fit within your data, standard, data center standards. Okay, and, and, and what kind of user would be attracted to this kind of high density kind of packaging? Yeah, we've had great traffic here at GTC, and now we've had folks from the finance industry that are running very com uh, computationally intensive quantitative analysis, uh, image processing, as well as academics in applied math or physics, other areas that could use that kind of compute power. Uh,